Hey everybody, it's Maxwell Ventura with Real Broker, broker associate here in downtown San Diego. This is my week in real estate, and we are in the 30th week of 2023. So first off, what am I sparking up here? This is a Oyo de Monterey Excalibur. There we go. There it is. Bam. I like to torch it up around the sides, around the edges, so it toasts nicely. Should probably open the door behind me as well. I think that'll, that'll help. The Excalibur is a Connecticut shade. Filler is a mix of Nicaraguan, uh, Dominican, and Honduran. It's a very creamy smoke, and so what makes it distinct is that it's aged in cedar, which gives it its distinct flavor profile. So, my week in real estate, it was a pretty eventful week. Uh, it was my birthday on the 20th. I turned, take a guess to see how old you think I am. Uh, I turned 37. And it was pretty low key. We had a good time. There was a group of five of us, close friends, that were able to make it. And uh, we went out to Del Frisco's and got a nice steak. I had a ribeye. And uh, then we went to the uh, reading room, which is attached to Seneca. You have to have a membership to get in there. One of our, one of our buddies has a membership. Um, that place is really cool. If you have a chance to go up there, go. They don't really allow you to take photos or video although I may have d done so in the bathroom. And then after uh, we had a cocktail at the reading room, we went to the uh, Cuban Cigar Factory right in Gaslamp, which was really cool because it was Comic-Con weekend, so it's just such a great place for people watching. You're, you're right on 5th, pretty much at the intersection of 5th and Market, which is the heart of Gaslamp. What else? So uh, we got a deal done. This market's really tough right now. And so I have a client where we've been in the market like battling for a while, like a handful of months now. And it's just, it's been really competitive. And so what happened was we had submitted an offer. We wrote a really strong offer, clean offer, followed up nonstop with the agent. But there was just someone that came and beat us out by a good I think it was 40, 45,000. Uh, it was a, it was a single family home in La Mesa. We came in at 920. They were at 965. And what I'm hearing a lot, and this is what happened in this particular situation, is that the buyer backed out. They simply got cold feet. It was after the inspection report came back, which we saw there was nothing major. So long story short, uh, the listing agent reached back out to us uh, before going back to market. That's that's typically what a good listing agent will do. And at behest of the seller, if they don't want to go through the rigmarole of going back to market, they'll reach out to their offers that they already had in hand that were in maybe second or third position. They reach out to that buyer's agent and they just want to clarify if that buyer is still interested. So that's what happened with us. They reached back out and we jumped on it. We said, absolutely, yes. So big win for my client. And it was one of, if not the nicest homes we looked at. So super excited for him. We've been looking for a while. He, he said, Maxwell, get me out of this market. <laughs> so that's exactly what, what we did. So I'm, I'm super excited for him. Aside from that, uh, I've got a few off markets right now. One is a duplex in Golden Hill, and there's an infill opportunity, and the plans are already done. So that's, uh, that's hot. We're trying to work that out right now, but it's not, it's not done yet. So if you are interested, let me know. And then I also have an off market. Uh, I would consider it either like a bachelor or a bachelorette, really nice pad in downtown. It's on 350 West Ash, so it's at the very southern part of Little Italy. It's a great location. It's, um, it's technically a studio because there's no walls, but you can put up to one or even two walls up. It's a little under 900 square feet, and the, the purchase price is going to be around 700000 It's already remodeled, so it's a really cool unit. If you're interested, let me know. I also have a coming soon in Otay Mesa. It's a, it's a pretty much brand new townhome. It's, it's constructed in 2021. 
It's a four bed, three bath, just under 1,700 square feet. It looks really nice. That's going to get listed in the next, I'd say, week and a half, two weeks at 670000 turnkey. So if you're interested in that, let me know. I also have an active listing right now on Montalvo Street in Point Loma. This uh, property has been remodeled. It's a single family home. It has extremely favorable zoning. It's an RM37, which allows one unit for every thousand square feet of lot space. We also have plans that are partially completed. By partially completed, I, I mean that we have a plan set. We've submitted it to the city. It's for, it's for a duplex with a rooftop deck. Each unit is a two bed, one and a half bath, 871 square feet. So the plans have been submitted to the city. We've already received back the first round of comments from every department, every phase. There's nothing major, but we're just looking for the incoming buyer to take the project the rest of the way. So they're already saving fees on the plan set with the architect, some, some already with the city, and the most important element is time. So that's available. That's in Point Loma. We just did a price drop. We're listed at 1149000 So reach out to me if you're interested. It's on a corner lot. And that duplex with, roof, with the rooftop deck will have amazing views of the water. Last but not least, I finished off my week last week with an amazing breathwork class. This is, was more of an intimate setting. It's at um, this individual's house. There was around 15 of us, which is actually a lot. Usually there's less. Um, an amazing, amazing breathwork class. It lasted for about, a, about an hour and a half some great learnings. Uh, so I would highly recommend anyone get into some breath work, whether it be at someone's house or um, in a classroom environment. That's my week in real estate. If you have any interest in buying or selling here in San Diego, I would love to sit down with you and discuss how we can meet your real estate needs and goals. Thank you so much, and I'll see you next week.